Alrighty boys, we're back again with another wipe. Yeah boys, I haven't played in a pretty long time. I'm hoping to make just a little sort of rock base. I might actually try around S5. We can run the road. We've got two gas stations. If one goes bad, we can... Oh, I do like over here too. I do like the double gas station. I mean, they are not the best. I might just go sus and check it out. See what's up. Check these two. And if they look pretty good, I live somewhere around here. I think that will start off for craft a spear building plan. Okay, we can check this out. I think almost 100% sure the cave's taken, but that yeah, looks needs full metal. Like, uh, super unfortunate someone built there, but let's be real, not surprised. Pretty good fucking luck, alright. Oh, there's a rock right here. Dude! Fucking kidding me, can't! At this point, guys, I was super frustrated, but despite this setback, I decided I would run back and hope that the guy didn't lock my tool cupboard that I placed down. Oh. Get off. Nice. All right. That's, a, that's all I care about. He can take everything. Pretty happy with that. That's awesome, man. I'm so happy. I'm so, so happy. And look, see, we could build up even onto the rock, man. That's going to be crazy. Wait, let me run this back to base. I'm going to start hitting some trees. Get a few nodes, farm up a bit. Get a few furnaces going. Yeah, really start upgrading the space slowly. A few people around, all right. Not too many. Got someone running there. Do like, really like. Kind of on edge because I know people are watching. Oh shit! Oh. We'll try to get some some cloth and shit, and we'll run back to base. Be friendly. Pussy. Might go check my body. It's it's probably all fucking good. There's nothing. Yeah, I did. Might go and start hitting some trees straight away. We just need to start farming up, really. I think. After creating the outer layer surrounding the TC, it's pretty hard to see because it's in the night time, but I upgraded it to the best I could with the materials that I had. As you can see, boys, yeah, it's coming along really nice with a little, little opening right here. We could chuck another door on here, I reckon. Um, yeah, yeah. After finishing off that layer of the base, I placed a sleeping bag and a few boxes, and I decided I would start farming the road for components. is going. Shit, and we're starting to progress, I know, very slowly. Nice. Now we got a fair bit of stone now. I might grab put this away. I'm gonna grab my paddle. Bone knife, not that. 
run out and I'll try to get that animal to think. Some <laughs> So I might put the door here, because if someone does camp me out the front, pretty much got no hope. I think two more trees, and then we go do something different. So we got a little bit of an airlock. Shit. First double door. Head back out and pump some barrels. Oh damn man. Ready, first little run. 100 scrap, pretty nice. Keep more than that. So what I'm gonna keep up to do, just these little small sort of trips. Gonna attempt to run the gas station again and yeah we'll fucking we'll see how that goes. Just need some wood and some stone. Go farm some barrels and then yeah scrap it I guess. Dude, actual fucking dog shit, man. A headshot straight away, dude. Instant headshot. Got a yoga. I have to go back. I have to go back. The weapon, just in case. Let's go, let's go. for a bit of a wood run, I think, too. <laughs> At least the top's all secure. Bit of a tight space, but works, I guess. Once we get some garage doors, definitely we'll free up the space. After some much needed base upgrades, I then decided to craft a tier 1 workbench and I crafted my first crossbow to hopefully even the playing field next time I'd head out. That's a pretty good run. You know, not, not for much shit, but a little bit of, a little bit of everything. Come on, come on, please, boys. I can't run down to that one. It's the same fucking group as before. You can only stick to that one. Pretty much all I can do. After dying at the gas station, I didn't really want to go back there as it was pretty much just a group of us uh, kids. They're running around, you know, not much I can do. So I just did a bit of farming, I hit a few barrels, and as you can see, from the large box, I managed to get a fair bit. The only hood I love is Bonnie and White. Dick the beer, man, for you in the chicken. You little fuck. Guess what? Guess what? Your shit. Fucking play. That's exactly what I fucking need, man. Revolver. 
I can learn that straight away, pretty much. At least now, got a bit of a gun. What, 60 scrap from that? That's pretty nice. Keep pump, pumping these farm rounds up. I'm gonna try, hopefully, build this second level. I reckon. I mean, that play wasn't nothing crazy, but pretty happy I got a gun. I'm thinking this make like a second sort of core sort of area. So this will obviously be the main core, and I'll just kind of build a another one on the outside, and that will go up to the second floor. Looking back on the video guys, the base wasn't really too efficient use of resources. I had a good idea of what I wanted in my head, but yeah, as I started building it kind of didn't really go to how I wanted it to. But yeah, I made, you know, I did I did what I could with what I had. Yeah, at least we're sealed in. Walls right there. Fuck, this is massive. Once I built the second level just out of twig, as you can see, I then just decided it was time to go for a big farm and run to finish upgrading the base. Fuck, man. Yeah, those guys actually ended up camping me for like 30 minutes waiting for me to come outside. But once they left, I pretty much just upgraded the base. I put down a few sheet metal doors, upgraded it, um, the rest of it to stone. I even researched the pistol and the revolver. And yeah, pretty much just changed up the flow of the base. You know, I replaced a lot of the boxes, the furnaces. And yeah, the base is looking a lot better now and just moves around a lot easier. I had to land like every single revolver shot, holy fuck. I literally didn't miss like, I think I missed like two, if I missed more, and he would have fucking killed me. I did mean, nice boys. 150 scrap, python. Continue up the road. Then I can always just loop back around. You scared the fuck out of me because I literally just checked behind me. Holy fuck. It's kind of nice. 100 cloth and sleeping bags. Do with that. Might try my luck at the gas station again. I did make a good play.
can't even fucking see shit. Dude, he almost got me too. I almost choked. There's a lot of farm around, to be honest. I don't want to do that, but I just, I just want to kill people. Big play, man. Look at that, man. What what I start with? One revolver. Now I've got two more. Semi. Got DB. Never had that. Didn't have the semi, man. All that damn shit. Nice. Semi learnt. The right place, right time like that. You sneak up, you just wait. You literally just get the loot, take that shit and run, man. Do the do the Usain Bolt. Oh, it's going off again. We'll run back here. Try to do the clean up again. Maybe third time lucky, I don't know. We'll see. We'll get on the roof. That noise makes me want to upgrade my base. Might run over. That. I was just about to run in the other direction. I kill this dude. Hey, got on you, Lamai. Ah, he made it inside. I leave him alone. That's all good, man. Fuck. One's running this way, one's running that way. I'll have to run. I was going to cut across here. But I'm scared he's going to come get me from there. So I just try to run. Try again. We'll run out one more time, I think. We, we've got a lot of gear sets anyway. So after this, I think I'll learn the DB. Then I do need to start saving up for tier two. Sure. Do a little bit of farming. Need some more metal ore. Mainly, I'd say. Yeah, at least it's pretty good. I got that saw blueprint, the semi pistol. If we get a tier two, I can start really. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, dude, he's three man. Look at him. He's clowning on him. I think even oh, Look at him. Sorry. Oh, dude, so close. Oh, unfortunate, unfortunate. Right, we'll try again, I think. I feel like I probably could have ran, but I just... I feel like sometimes you just got to go for the fun.
run this back to base, at least that will make up for the pickaxes I've lost. And I'll run over in that way. Hi, oh, come on, guys. These cunts, man, swear to fucking god, there's like five of them, man. And I'm probably gonna have to get up. I know where I fucking live. Hello? Open the door, my team. And uh, ten people. I might look through and see exactly what we got, just a bit of organizing. Little bear rugs on. We do have some alright security, I guess. Top level. Kind of useless. I guess it's just kind of for honeycomb, really, <laughs> at the moment. How that means. A few. Oh! My god, that scared the fuck out of me. I thought he ran. Run it back with the fucking gun. Need to do. One thirty a.m. So, like I said, everyone's kind of getting off. There's only really a few people on. That dude with the knife before, man. He, he outplayed me, man. So hard. Actually, thought he. I actually thought he was running. At this point, guys, I was getting super tired, and yeah, I pretty much just farmed for the rest of the night. I just needed a bit to, you know, put in my furnaces, and also some for upkeep. So yeah, I just took a break for a few hours, had a bit of a power nap, and yeah, I'll see you pretty much tomorrow. What I might do is, I might just go on a big fucking trek with the hazmat. out of this tree line man or just gonna get shit on might try this gas station actually Not looted. I do want to get the other two but I, I don't want to greed man like if I get this home I got enough to upgrade like the roof put another door on Hopefully they left my pick My pickaxe and maybe I can just go mine and run it back Just chuck a door here just to separate it I guess Upgrade the triangle here This is PC is just high quality here. Upgrade the roof. Yes, if they blow down, at least it's a bit more protection. And they're probably going to blow from the side, but I feel like that might sort of trick them. Hopefully. I think that's pretty good, as good as it can get, so... At least now it's kind of separated. You know, I've got another sort of little room up here upstairs. Maybe I could stash some loot. Probably won't do it today, but see you tomorrow. Anyways, guys, yeah, after that, I went on a pretty much a good farming run. I tried to get as much supplies as I can for the day. That way, I don't have to farm again. And, yeah, I'm pretty much just looking for PvP now, as I just want to uh, make a tier 2 and then start uh, making SARS. Might jump up on top, and then I'll suss kind of like the area around. And then if it looks clear, I'll just farm the road, come back and, come back and scrap it, I mean, sorry.
I need to be quicker with fucking looting, man. Taking too long. That's actually crazy, man. I snuck past those two dudes. They, they had SARS as well, so it's scary. They would have heard my gunshots and definitely ran down. I think that's awesome, guys. Wow, big run. 170 scrap. Scrapped a lot of shit, a lot of components. Pump out all this trash. I'll see you. That revolver definitely comes in handy when you miss. Awesome. Wow, 300 scrap. We're getting even closer. <laughs> That's kind of a lucky deal. I might bring the DB just because I have so many. And like I said, this is probably going to be the last day I play. So maybe like on those Sark kids, if I just hide around a corner, you might come in luck. I'm a bit nervous because I've seen those two Sark dudes, like I said before. Dude, I, d I literally got down that fucking quick. Literally one spray, dead. I should have waited with the DB, like I said. Oh, there's two of them anyways. I think it's the two dudes from before. I just run with what I've got here. And then, yeah, that's pretty much what I do. I roam the roads. And I'll just farm the roads and run it back. I don't need a lot, really. I'll make a few runs of like 50 each time. I know it's not a lot, but definitely add up. I should get 36 scrap, like, that's all right, but a few more of those, and I'll definitely have enough. A little bit worried about going back to that gas station. Anyways, boys, yeah, I pretty much just kept on doing those little runs. I kept running maybe 30 scrap back each time, but yeah, this kill you're seeing is pretty much the only kill I got in the next hour or so. I bait him in. Bait him in? I'll bait him in, boys, with the robot. <laughs> watch, 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 he'll come running. Pull out the revolver, instant death. Dude, I can't believe that I actually worked out. Not surprised. Like that, I feel like that happens so much. You just like, you either get baited yourself or you bait someone else. Like literally 100 scrap off that free. Alrighty, well, I think I've got enough. Wow, yup, we've got enough, boys. Most of my wipes are hard stuck with the revolver. Rimlocked. Now look at that. Oh, we got so many blueprints. Like we lit, what did we get? We got the med syringe, semi pistol, semi rifle, python. Revolver, flashlight, both the bullets, pretty, pretty set. At this point, boys, the video is getting close to the end as I don't really have a lot of time to play. But yeah, I, you pretty much can already tell by looking at the duration of it left. But yeah, I pretty much just wanted to um, make a few kits and yeah, start roaming with the SAR and look for some PvP. Slide on my gun. not drop him I fucking hit that cut like six times that is actual heartbreak right there lost my gun instantly I think I should have I kind of had a feeling there's gonna be two but I just seen that one dude I got too fucking excited just wanted to start shooting straight away dude. <laughs> Dude, my aunt, oh, I'm trash. I'm actually fucking trash. 
I thought he was naked, so I just stopped. Like, I just literally was watching him. I was like, oh, no, he's got nothing. And then... And then I seen the pistol, and I was like, fuck, I started reacting, and then it's too fucking late. Anyways, boys, that's pretty much all I got time for left in the video, so yeah. I'll give you a quick tour of the base. So, as you can see from the outside, you pretty much can just see I've pretty much just built straight into the rock. And it's good that you pretty much save half the resources, I'd say, because... The Raiders pretty much have to go from one side. And yeah, I pretty much just wedged the TC up as far as I can to the wall. I, I didn't really use like the resources efficiently, I could say. I feel like the base was pretty big for me. It did have a lot of room, but I feel like, I don't know, it just wasn't really efficient the way I built it. It was just kind of a bit like clunky. But yeah, it still did pretty good. I feel like... You know, you definitely could build out of it. Maybe if there was like two or three of you, you definitely could build it up. You know, have a shooting floor and yeah, things like that. But yeah, moving right into the base now, you can see it kind of like, it just tunnels in. You know, you can see the rock there on the right hand side. And it's just kind of a nice flow. You know what I'm saying? You walk further in and it's just real smooth, you know, running to the right. And yeah, you pretty much just see the, the rock face there. And you got the TC just wedged in, like I said, and yeah. I, I do like it in the end, but yeah, next time I'll probably watch a video instead of just trying to build it myself. But yeah, anyways guys, thanks for sticking with me and thanks for watching if you made it to the end. I know this is like the, the first upload I've done in eight months, but yeah, I just had to take a, a bit of a break, you know what I mean? Sometimes, you know, you play the same shit for months and months and you, you know, you kind of get over it. But yeah, boys, I'm, I'm back now, you know, I'm having a lot of fun playing and yeah, I'm, I'm happy to make more videos and yeah, hopefully you guys stick with me and I'll, I'll see you all in the future. Thank you all so much for watching.